Hey guys, what's up? This is Tony Teaches Tech. I'm Tony, and in this video, we're gonna be looking at comparing two managed WordPress hosting providers. The first one is Flywheel, and the second one is Kinsta. Now, the cheapest plan at Flywheel is a $13 per month plan, and the cheapest plan at Kinsta is over twice that at $30 per month. Does that mean Kinsta is a better WordPress hosting provider? Does that make it a faster WordPress hosting provider? That's what I wanted to find out in this video. Let's see. Okay guys, so before we get into the results of the speed test, I wanna to talk to you about how I actually conducted the speed tests. So in order to you know ensure a level playing field, I did some research and found out where the data centers are located for each of these two hosting providers. Kinsta has a whole load of data centers. I think it's something like 20 plus data centers, while Flywheel only has a handful of data centers, but a common location between the two is in London. So that's where I set up two identical WordPress websites with a single 1500 word blog post and three images. I then proceeded to set up a test client in Paris and ran a series of 100 back-to-back -back page speed tests from Paris to each of the respective data centers in London. And one last thing I'll mention here is that besides the default optimizations, which primarily is the server level caching for each one of these hosting providers, there were no additional optimizations like WordPress plugins or anything. This was a basic out of the box test to see which one of these hosting providers is faster. So with the results in, let's look at the first set of page speed tests. And that metric is the server response time. On average, Kinsta responded in just 19 milliseconds, while Flywheel, on the other hand, had a 57 millisecond average response time. The second set of tests was the time to first paint, and Kinsta, on average, responded in 421 milliseconds, while Flywheel, on the other hand, was 472 milliseconds. And finally, and probably most importantly, the last set of tests here was the page load time, Kinsta on average 509 milliseconds, while Flywheel had an average page load time of 631 milliseconds. Now guys, it seems like Kinsta is the clear winner here, but I wanted to be as comprehensive as possible. So I moved the test server from Paris to New York and ran the same series of 100 back-to-back -back page speed tests from New York to each of the respective data centers back in London. And let's look at the results for the second round of tests here, starting off with the server response time yet again, Kinsta on average 78 milliseconds and Flywheel had on average 159 milliseconds. Second test here, time to first paint, Kinsta beat out Flywheel yet again with 670 milliseconds, Flywheel on the other hand 711 milliseconds. Finally, last but not least, is the page load time. This one, Kinsta, was 947 milliseconds, while Flywheel actually beat out Kinsta by a matter of 27 milliseconds with a page load time on average of 920 milliseconds. So guys, it seemed like Kinsta was gonna be the clear winner here until that last page speed test. But when we do consider all tests, I would say that Kinsta was the better WordPress host here. You know, when we go back and look at it, Kinsta was 200% faster than Flywheel with the, the server response time domestically from Paris to London. It was 20% faster for the page load time domestically. And the truth is Flywheel was only 3% faster than Kinsta when we looked at the page load time from New York to London. So all things considered, Kinsta is a more premium WordPress hosting provider than Flywheel. The speed test points to that, the fact that it's more expensive than Flywheel points to that, and also the fact that Kinsta has many, many more data locations, data center locations around the world than Flywheel, um, just makes it a more premium WordPress hosting provider than Flywheel. And with that, you just gotta figure out what's more important to you. Is your website site speed more important to you? Are you willing to pay a little bit more for that? Or is your budget more of a priority for you? In that case, you should probably go with Flywheel. So yeah, that's all I got for you guys in this video. If you have any questions, let me know in the comments below and check out some of my other videos for what I consider to be the fastest WordPress hosting provider. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up. If you really liked it, subscribe. And if you do, I'll see you in the next one.